Hi everyone, I'm Razia. Welcome to my channel. Please do subscribe if you haven't already and don't forget to hit the notification bell. You can also follow me on TikTok and Instagram for more content. I've been getting a lot of questions from you guys recently about strawberry legs. So this video is going to be dedicated to strawberry legs and everything you need to know about them. What causes them, how to get rid of them and how to keep them away for good. <laughs> I do want to preface this video by saying having strawberry skin on your legs is completely normal. It is very common, more common than you think. Unfortunately, we do live in this society that shames a lot of very normal skin conditions, whether that's hyperpigmentation or acne or strawberry legs. A lot of people have these issues. They're very common, very normal to have, but a lot of us feel ashamed for having them, which is ridiculous. Don't be ashamed of having whatever skin condition you have. It's normal and it's very, very common. Yes, it is a skin condition and yes, it is something that we can treat. So that's what we're gonna be discussing in this video. But, but if you are dealing with confidence issues and maybe you're ashamed of whatever it is that you might have in your skin, please, please don't feel that way. It is very normal, it is very common. Just because you don't see it all over social media doesn't mean it doesn't exist. Yes, there are ways we can fix it and I hope this video does help you in that way. But don't hate yourself, don't be, don't be so hard on yourself, don't be so mean to yourself because you don't deserve that, you deserve better. So I just wanted to preface this video by saying that. Before we can talk about how to treat strawberry legs, I think it's important to understand what causes them in the first place. Strawberry legs occur when the enlarged pores or the hair follicle on your skin traps dead skin, oil and bacteria. And, and this leads to the appearance of dark dots on the surface of the skin, hence the name strawberry legs because it resembles the outer appearance of strawberry. <laughs> In case you didn't know where the name came from, <laughs> that's where it came from. <laughs> if you do find the area to be itchy or even painful, that is something to consult your doctor about. Otherwise, it is a harmless skin condition. Some other common causes of strawberry skin are dry skin, folliculitis or keratosis pilaris. This video is gonna be the guide you need to help you get rid of that because honestly, when I was dealing with this issue and I was trying to research on the internet, I couldn't find anything helpful at all. And a lot of the videos were basically just talking about making your own DIY sugar scrubs and using a combination of sugar and lemon and all these weird different combinations and scrubbing that onto your legs was gonna get rid of this issue. And I think there's a lot of brands that try to capitalize on this and, and use this type of false marketing where use this sugar scrub and it'll get rid of all your strawberry skin, use this cream and it'll get rid of your cellulite and your stretch marks. I mean, that none of those things are possible by using those products. So it's really unfortunate that you have a lot of this marketing where they just use these false claims. People fall into their traps, unfortunately. And I mean, these products just don't work. Hopefully this video helps you out and this will be your no BS guide to getting rid of strawberry legs. Since strawberry legs are basically just clogged pores or clogged hair follicles on the skin, we simply just need to unclog those pores. What's the best way to unclog your pores? Exfoliate. Exfoliating really is just the solution to all your problems. And we really do owe exfoliating a lot. I mean, what doesn't exfoliating do for us? Really, it's, it's amazing. Exfoliating removes dead skin cells and impurities on the surface of your skin and can really also help with smoothing skin texture out as well. And that's why exfoliating is the best solution when it comes to unclogging those pores and unclogging those hair follicles on your legs. You've either got chemical or physical exfoliating and I definitely recommend using chemical exfoliating. It's a lot more thorough and it definitely gets the job done in a much more effective way. And it's definitely more of a long-term solution as well. Physical exfoliants are more of a temporary solution. They just give you the temporary feeling of smooth skin without actually doing anything. The first product I'm gonna mention is the Skinstitute Glycolic Scrub 14%. This one is both a chemical and physical exfoliant. It has the glycolic acid in there, which, which is really gonna work on the skin to get rid of those dead skin cells and clean out those hair follicles. And it also has jojoba beads in there that give it a bit of a gritty texture. I really, really enjoy this one and it's a higher percentage of glycolic acid as well. So it's definitely a very effective product and one that I highly recommend. For best results when exfoliating, it is good to use it a couple times a week, up to two to three times a week. If you don't want a physical scrub, they also have a glycolic cleanser, 12%, and that's another great solution for you as well. Salicylic acid is another great option to really get into those pores and unclog them. This 
This cleanser from La Roche-Posay is their Micro Peeling Purifying Gel. This one contains 2% salicylic acid and that's another way you can effectively exfoliate your legs to help with your strawberry legs. To really get the most benefit out of using an exfoliating wash on the area, use the cleanser on that area, really work it into the skin and then let it sit on the skin for a couple of minutes to really let the active ingredients do their job before washing it off. Using the exfoliating cleansers just before shaving can really help to clean out the area before you do shave. And you can also use them on days when you're not shaving. It doesn't have to be only on the days you shave. Exfoliating is the real superhero here. So you want to exfoliate pre-shave and you also want to use some leave-on exfoliants on the skin to really let those active ingredients do their work and to make sure you're getting the best results possible. There are some lotions available that do have these active ingredients in there. The first one I can recommend is the Paula's Choice 2% Weightless Body Treatment. This one has 2% salicylic acid in there and that can really help to keep those pores nice and clean. I really couldn't find too many body lotions that do contain active ingredients, but there's an easy way around this. You can use an exfoliating toner in the area as well. This is something that I used to do as well and this really made a huge difference for me. This doesn't have to be something you do only if you're shaving and want to get rid of strawberry legs, but this can be something you do just in general, just to maintain your skin and keep it nice and soft. This one from The Ordinary is their Glycolic Acid 7% Toning Solution, and I would just apply this to my skin and then top it off with a moisturizer. And that, that's just a great way to put a leave-on exfoliate on the skin and let it do its job. I mean, the same way you would put an exfoliator on your face, you can do the same on your body and you'll get really great results as well. If you wanted something with salicylic acid, you can use the Paula's Choice 2% BHA Liquid Exfoliant. That's a great exfoliant. And if you're looking for something with salicylic acid, I definitely recommend that one. And just make sure you top it off with a moisturizer. When trying to get rid of strawberry legs, moisturizing is really, really important. Please don't skip moisturizer. Having dry skin can really accentuate the appearance of these dark spots. The combination of using an exfoliating wash, a leave-on exfoliant, and moisturizing is what's going to do the magic for you. Not using sugar, coffee scrubs, a lemon, all these weird sort of treatments. Make sure you do stay consistent. This is not an overnight solution. There is no such thing as an overnight solution to anything, especially when it comes to skin issues. Stay consistent, do this a couple of times a week and you will see results. Make sure you do take pictures of the area as well and that way you're able to track your progress and you will start to see improvements. There are some treatments you can do to help with strawberry legs. This includes laser hair removal and also electrolysis. While these treatments can be effective, they're definitely costly. Personally, I did laser hair removal a couple of years ago and it really made a huge difference in improving my strawberry skin. While doing the laser hair removal, I was also using the glycolic scrub from Skinstitute and I was using the Ordinary Glycolic Acid Toner post shower as well. And I think if I wasn't doing those two things, I wouldn't have had as good results as I have with, with laser. So it is definitely something to keep in mind, whether you're doing laser or not, or just shaving, just make sure you do exfoliate because it makes such a difference in making your skin look really nice and clear. That's all I've got for this one today. I really hope this video was useful. Please let me know down in the comments below if you found any of these tips useful. And if you have any tips that you've used for strawberry, for dealing with strawberry legs, please do let us know in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching guys and don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.